Hey everyone, welcome back to the place where we are testing every single mask on Amazon. Yes, even KN95s that the FDA is no longer giving emergency use to. Yeah, I'm being petty. That's what we do here. Welcome to the show. All right, uh, let's get this guy in the clamper and we will start testing this mother. Actually, really uh, don't mind this brand, brand called Huheta. Uh, I think I've tested a I need like scissors or something. This, this guy's really sealed. Um, we've tested like uh, two or three of these before, but the surgical masks. And um, it's really, I've always appreciated the brand. Um, oh, you can get a free warranty. You want to warranty your masks? Questionable. All right, let's open this up. Individually packed, a sealed, look at that. And it's not like some temporary seal, it's a real seal. That's awesome. It's a little bit different than what we do for our surgical masks. So I'm gonna put a link up here if you wanna see how that has changed. It's PFE machine, particulate filtration efficiency machines. Why we're showing up today. Is that mask going to protect you? Now look, you need both fit and filtration to have a good mask. I trust you guys at home to figure out if you've got any gaps in your fit, but I don't think most of you have a $250,000 lab to be able to figure out how good the filtration is. Let's take a look at the listing. Always good listings. Look at this, 13,000 ratings. Can 95 face mask, packed individually. Filter efficiency, 95%. Uh, all right, let's look at the uh, actual box. I actually noticed something here. First of all, this box is dope. It's a uh, it's a, a corrugated box, which means you can ship this mother, which is just really efficient. You can put a label right on it and ship it. Um, it's very, very, very strong. And it's black and it looks cool. Filtration 95%, can 95. Now they're saying GB2626-2019 on that. Ooh, what are all those numbers, Lloyd? That's a great question. Lloyd, I'm glad you asked, Lloyd. That is saying that this is a KN95 mask meeting the Chinese standards of GB2626. Um, I know, who here read the standards, huh? Anybody? Any? Oh, it's me, I'm a dork, all right. I can tell you right away that this does not meet the standards because the standards say that you have to put on the actual mask itself, KN95, the manufacturer name, and you have to say GB2626 dash whatever year standard you're using. So most people are using 2006, that's old. Uh, I've got people who were made after that. Um, <laughs> uh, but this one's the updated standard, the 2019, which absolutely reinforces those points. Very surprised in who had a for not actually meeting it, especially with these soft, supple ear loops that they have. Speaking of ear loops, ooh, that's pretty nice. Yeah, I like that. That's good. That's strong. I'm going to try to break it here. It's going to hurt me, but I'm not going to cry. Not this time. No tears. It's a good, it's a good ear loop. Great construction, great nose wire, uh, super soft. Let's put it on. Of course, you got the duck. That's the look you're going for with KN95. Not my fave, but it's up to you. Um, a little tight, uh, but good seal, definitely. And it's got, you know what the smell is? The patented Chinese KN95 smell. I swear, it's like they, they, they like inject it with the same smell. It's not terrible. Uh, it smells new. Um, but you know when you're smelling a new car? Guess what you're smelling? Chemicals. Anyway, but does that matter? I mean, who cares? Do you care, really? Do you care if they're meeting the KN95 standard? If this machine tells you that it's safe? I don't know. Let's find out. I guess we can't find out if you care or not, but we can find out what the score is. 99.68%, dang! That's really, really freaking good. Who had a, uh, as far as I can remember, has done usually a good job, so I'm not surprised by that. I'm surprised that they're not meeting the standard that they claim, that's just weird. Um, but it's giving you the filtration, so anyways. I hope this was helpful if you end up buying these masks because you saw this review. Hey, this is an exchange, it's the internet, and the currency of the internet is likes and subscribes. I've given to you, give to me, that's all I'm asking. All right, I will catch you on the next test. Stick with me, folks. All right, see you later.